welcome to today's vlog from uh, sunny North Queensland. Nice blue skies today, it's really, really warm. Um, but uh, basically just coming off, starting the morning uh, with a quick walk really. Um, it's gonna be the last time I walk, I'm down here for a while I would say. So, uh, just enjoying the view and uh, then off to the airport. All right, so just gonna head off and check out of the accommodation now and then grab one of the cars and uh, head to the airport. Stage one of today's trip. All right, so we made it to Weeper Airport, one of the smaller airports I've been to. Um, so, gonna go ahead and, uh, and get checked in. Wonderful, thank you very much. Yes, yes. Yeah. Oh, really? Wonderful. Thank you very much. large carry-on bags into the overhead lockers and smaller bags under the seats in front of you. If you are seated at an emergency exit, all bags must be placed. told me that uh, there's a bus that runs from the airport straight there every half an hour uh, from bay number six I think it was so I'm gonna head over there now and uh, see what happens otherwise we're in a taxi I wave too fast but in my heart I understand I made my move it was all I feel so far away you were the one thing in my way you were the one thing in my way you were the one thing in my way it's going to be another couple of minutes on the bus before we get to the accommodation. Uh, the plan of action really for the rest of the day is just to explore care and see what's about. And um, yeah, uh, I've got to go and get my iPhone fixed. Uh, the screen the screen stopped working like last week for some reason. So I'm uh, going to try and get that fixed. It's a Sunday, so we've only got a couple of hours to get everything done before the shop shut. Uh, so that's the main thing. Get the phone fixed and uh, just have an explore around Cairns. It's, so far, it looks really, really nice. Um, yeah, proper, proper tropical place. Uh, my kind of place. Why 
least I did in my way. So uh, warping into the evening now and uh, got to go and get some food because I haven't eaten in the last few hours um, and I'm going to have a big long bus trip tomorrow so not going to have much of a chance to eat some good food so um, one place I'm going to go take a look at is the casino here, uh, most of the casinos around here have good food offerings so just go in there see what options they've got. Well after all that I uh, only spent about probably not even 10 minutes in there. Uh, probably the smallest casino I've ever seen and um, and had a couple of restaurants. It looks like they've uh, looks like they've got a lot of construction underway at the moment. So uh, yeah, that's all right. We'll keep exploring and uh, hopefully we'll find something shortly. Look at this place. It's crazy. It's a massive pool. I don't think you can swim in the water out there because of all the. Uh, stingers and things but which is nice it's huge as well and it's warm it's like eight o'clock at night and this water is like being in a bath uh, it goes to show how hot it is here during the day though yeah so this bit's pretty shallow around here but uh, up up here is the ocean in the background so it's a bit like an infinity pool really it looks it's really nice um, so it's a bit of a shame we didn't get down here earlier in the day but nevertheless and we've even got some entertainment as well. All right, well I've just uh, picked up some sandwiches from the uh, the shop around the corner. Uh, after our dinner there, just because I think I'm not going to get a chance to go to a restaurant or a cafe in the morning um, before the bus leaves, because it's pretty early. It's about a, about a six o'clock. Uh, I've got to leave on the bus, so I'm not sure if there'll be anything open. Um, so I'm going to leave it here for this evening, and uh, see you tomorrow. See you in the morning.